are together can you hear me are together can you hear me yes ma'am
from avalanche glaciation flood. Avalanche glaciation flood is oxygen plus pheosian plus oxygen. Oxygen. Can I? Pheosian because plus oxygen chloride. So making sure that five chlorine is one. Three plus one, five minutes. Another pattern of preparation is R O H plus SOCL. Uh, it is the best method for the preparation of R C L with the side products are yes, that is R C L plus S O P plus S. R C L plus S O P plus S. Oh, R O H. By the red phosphorus and chlorine. Red phosphorus and CO2, you get the mass. These are the general methods of preparation. Purple halide from cap force. Now, aryl alcohol will not give such aryl halide because aryl alcohol, what is the situation of aryl alcohol? This is aryl alcohol or phenol, aryl alcohol or phenol. Now, what happens due to the resonance? There is a partial double bond character between carbon and oxygen. So, this double bond cannot be one means double attraction. This cannot be moving easily. That bond will not be moving. So, the white cannot be moved by CO. So, we are showing the resonance structures of RH, ARH. O is losing some water. So I'm putting a positive charge over here. It's got a double bond character. Now this will end up here, so this one will be shifted here. So next to the same structure. This will end up here. The next one of the structure is available. And this can go here, this can go back. Among these five resonance structures, maximum are having double bond. Majority are having double bond between carbon and uh, O. So this cannot be broken. So aryl alcohol. So that bond is not broken. So it cannot be replaced by CL. So aryl chloride will not be obtained by this Ma'am? Yes. Ma'am, uh, actually, Jason said that he is unable to enter. He has entered. He came late, just now only he came. Okay, ma'am. I admitted him. His name is shown in the participants. Method of preparation of alkyl halide is from hydrocarbons. Hydrocarbons compounds having carbon and hydrogen as the constants from hydrocarbons. Can we say hydrocarbons first and foremost thing that comes to our mind is like CH3 or CH3 or CH4C? 
These hydrogens are called alkyl hydrogens. One of the hydrogens can be replaced, two of hydrogens can be replaced, all hydrogens can be replaced by chlorine. So you can make halo compounds from hydrocarbons. These hydrogens are called alkyl hydrogens. And these alkyl hydrogens can be replaced by chlorine in presence of sunlight. We write it as H new cylinder. And replacing one hydrogen and to get the mono and how many you want to make? You can make uh, dihydro, trihydro, tetrahydro. These so many compounds can be obtained. These compounds can be separated by fractional distillation. So I am writing mono halo. Any number of hydrogens can be replaced by Cl. And hydrogens are replaced by H new Cl. Another type of that is alkyl CH CH2 double bond CH These are these hydrogens are alkyl hydrogens only, but these three hydrogens are called alkyl. Alkyl hydrogens can be replaced by UDVR. So you can get the product CH double bond, CH single bond, CH double bond. Even if you like a seal there, no problem. Once you should be that, and I like it. Another hydrogen is or another type of benzyl hydrogen that is the benzene here, CH3. This is tolerated. This is tolerated. So here, you, if you see, a double bond is there, a double bond is there. Then a double bond carbon it is attached to another carbon on which three hydrogens are there. So to replace this hydrogen, you can use what you can use it, double bond and then single bond carbon. Double bond and single bond carbon. Here double bond, single bond carbon, and the hydrogens. Then again, UDBR. You will get the So this is these hydrogens are called benzyl hydrogen. Benzyl hydrogen. See, there is a double bond similarly we have also that double bond hydrogen is in the aromatic system, so we call it as benzyl These hydrogens are alkyl hydrogens. These hydrogens are benzyl benzyl. So, alkyl hydrogens are replaced by HCl2. Alkyl or benzyl hydrogens are replaced by UVPR2. Then, what about type of hydrogens are there? Aldyl. Its hydrogen is directly attached to benzene. Then, six hydrogens are there. It is understood. You don't have to show the hydrogens of benzene, right? It is understood there are six hydrogens. Suppose you are using Br2 FeBr3, and all hydrogens are replaced by Br2 FeBr3, Cl2 FeCl3, Cl2 AgCl3, Cl2 FeCl3, like that, with iron or Cl2 in presence of iron or Br2 in presence of iron in the so we are to FEBR. Then array hydrogen is increased in down. If it is solving, if it is solving, so these are benzyl hydrogens. If you are using we are to FEBR, we are to FEBR. Only array hydrogens will be replaced. Then so C3 is there, C3 is there. So para for you will do, you will be getting ortho bromo Ortho bromo and para bromo plus para bromo Beyond para bromo They can be separated by 
fractional distribution. Here, if you solid state, in solid state by melting points, by checking the melting points, you can separate them. If it is in solid format, then by melting point, how melting point? This will be having higher melting point due to its uh, symmetry, the better packing. Better packing, this is will be uh, so many molecules of this type will be under pack, with packing efficiency, with the high packing efficiency. So this is very well packed. So disturb them, you have to supply more heat energy than this melting point of this pack will be higher. Next method of preparation is from annihilation. Annihilation first you have to diastasize it and next this is annihilation. Annihilation is treated with. NaNO2 when separated at CL 0 degree Celsius means you can write below 5 degree Celsius. It will undergo a typical reaction called diazotization. Diazotization. On diazotization, aniline gives benzene diazonium chloride. Benzene diazonium chloride and triple bond N. So this is positive and so benzene diazonium and triple bond N as so and triple bond N that is as so. So we want that we benzene diazonium chloride. From this, by taking plus chloride, so you do CN2 gives chlorobenzene. CO2 Br, also we have to make CUDR. We have to make CUDR. Diamond, this is a diamond. Romo-benzene. And KI gives hydrogen. KI gives KI. KI gives hydrogen. KI gives hydrogen. We haven't said anything about fluoro now. So prepare fluoro compounds. From hydrocarbons, you can use addition reactions. Addition of Br2 to alkenes, unsaturation, you can prepare halo compounds. Addition Br2 to double bonds. CH2 double bond C addition reaction. Addition reactions are the characteristic reactions of unsaturation. It's double bond and triple bond. If double bond and triple bond both are present, addition will be taking place at double bond. Because double bond is direction. Triple bond is always rotating. So due to that rotation, it attains stability. So triple bond on triple bond at normal condition, addition will not be taken. So to make addition reaction of triple bond, you have to use a catalyst, nickel, palladium, palladium, or platinum. So we are two. One BR can go to one carbon, another BR can go to another. So see it's two BR. Now double bond can be a single bond and see it's two BR. This is symmetric, that is also symmetric. Addendum, substrate and addendum, both are symmetric. Now, if CH2, CH2, HDR, 
Then it is symmetric. One x goes to one carbon, p r goes to the other carbon. One one carbon is something. P r. So x I can write as c h three and c h three. H p r addition with h p r addition, uh, you know, any product you can write because this is symmetric. Last year you learned if this thing is unsymmetric, that is. C H three, C H double bond, C H three. If this is asymmetric, then H P R addition follows what? Oxygen, what oxygen? Hydrogen or the hydrogen? And then will be added to more hydrogenated carbon, double bonded, double bonded carbon with more hydrogen carbon, and another will be added to less hydrogen carbon. So this will be given. Yes. Real and pure. But in presence of peroxide, anti-carbonic group will be followed. So you'll be getting a one group of CH3, CH double bond, CH2, HPR, peroxide. Peroxide, you'll be getting a one group of CH3. CH2 is a one-bromine substrate. Plus HBr of the right product. Alkene is unsymmetric. What is the product you have made? Anyone? Now this is more hydrogenated carbon, so the hydrogen will be added to more hydrogenated carbon, and bromine will be added to less hydrogenated So this is the product that is a mark of the box. Next is Fingles by Fingles chain reaction that is had on each stage. Fingles chain reaction that is halogen exchange. Halogen exchange. H 
NaI in presence of NaR, right as a no, right as a no, should be the numbers. You will be getting CH3I and NaR. So by having an exchange also from one level, you can get another halogen. That is halogen exchange. The last method of preparation is by Swartz reaction. By Swartz reaction. Again, CH3BR, CH3BR. We can take metallic fluor, that is AGF, F3, SB, F3, F4, SB, F3. You can make CH3F, only one other for the ratio of fluid, AG4. AG. So these are the methods of preparation. Then we'll be going to the physical properties and then chemical properties. Thank you.